Was SpongeBob spying on kids? Here's five wild Nickelodeon facts that aren't in Quiet on Set. You remember Gak? Did you know it was named for illegal substances? Folks behind the scenes love the old nose candy so much that they named a toy after it, Gak. The original Nickelodeon kids were ripped off when it came to pay. Even in 1997, All That's Lee and Frierson revealed he made $2,000 per episode when adult actors made over 20 grand. One of Nickelodeon's most profane shows wasn't even a cartoon, it was Double Dare. Host Mark Summers said kids would curse up a storm when running the obstacle course. Nickelodeon animators loved Dee Dee from Rugrats, so much so the Nickelodeon animators drew Dee Dee in some risque positions and actually posted them in studio bathrooms. And finally, SpongeBob was actually spying on kids. In 2016, it came out that the SpongeBob games on the Nickelodeon website collected data and gave targeted ads to its children users. So let me know if any of these are even surprising.